Yep. Let's pick up our second KO. Dude, Tusk is insane, bro. Tusk is just gonna run through this whole team. Specs Fluttermane's also pretty good. I could also just go like Sash, dude. Actually, that's not bad. That's not bad. Gothitelle can't get trapped. I think my last monster is gonna be him. Do I want you or you? I think I'm gonna go with Golden Go. It's a little bit less restrictive. Fluttermane Amoongus. Um, Wolf's Fluttermane with Sash, right? Do I Tailwind and Terra Grass here? I think I do. Audio died? Let me fix that. Okay. Should be back. All right, sweet. Uh, let's go ahead and taunt the Amoongus and go for Earthquake. Actually, don't want to Earthquake. I could just Headlong Rush. I think I Earthquake. Even though I hit my Talonflame, I don't think I lose Talonflame because I'm like max HP and it's resisted. Yeah, we'll just Earthquake. It, it hits basically everything. I'm also Sash on my uh, Great Tusk, so I don't drop to Moonblast. Yeah. Cool. So with this, I'm actually pretty willing to just double the, uh, the Amoongus. Just to secure a KO. Doesn't seem that bad. Because I also catch any switch ins. They withdraw Flutter Main, cool. Yeah, this is what I want. I don't want them to like pollen puff me. This will, do, this will still do a decent amount. I might still KO Amoongus, it's going to be kind of close. No, not even close, actually. <laughs> I'd imagine I lose my, my Tusk here. If I don't, that'd be a miracle. Good damage on Tusk. Pollen Puff? Spore, okay. Nice. Uh, pretty sure he had extreme speed on the Arcanine, so here I want to taunt. And go right into my golden go. Maybe I go Gothitelle? Eh, we'll go golden go. Yeah. Maybe I should have just Bray Birded. Oh, they were Mental Herb. Yeah, I forgot about that. Alright, that's not that bad. Tailwind's gone. I can, I can get in my Gothitelle here and actually, like, go for Trick Room. 
That's not bad. Actually, going for Trick Room seems really good if I can secure a KO on the uh, on the Arcanine. I think I'm going to do that. Does Life Orb make it rain do it? It's kind of rough. I'm going to go for it. It's like super risky, don't get me wrong. Oh wait, it's Assault Vest on the Arcanine, so no it doesn't. No it doesn't. I think I still have to like try though. Actually, no, I just Shadow Ball the Amoongus in Trick Room. Yeah, cool, got that play. Oh, interesting. I don't know why they would double protect there. <laughs> I think they disconnected after seeing the Trick Room. That's my theory. I think they got really pissed. <laughs> I think they just rage quit after that. <laughs> okay. Incredible. Thank you. Is Double Protect ever a good play? For stalling out Trick Room, not letting your opponent get it up. Yeah, we'll take those. That that was that was basically a forfeit. Alright, looks like we're just playing like hyper offense. For this one, for this one, I still just really like this lead. I don't know if they have much for it beyond Gyarados. Like, Gyarados could be bad, right? But, like, the lead's still threatening. I definitely go Golden Go. Do I go Flutter here? I do. I don't see a need for Grim. I was wondering why my views were low right now, and then I realized the people who would usually watch me are watching OCIC, so I don't blame them. Iron Moth and Golden Go. I'm assuming they're booster. Yes, they are. So I don't outspeed Iron Moth at plus two. Pretty sure I don't. I actually think I, I have to be Jolly. And no, I do. I do. I'm not sure, but I do. Not certain. Totally do. Let me check. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing the play anyways, right? But I have to check. Gyarados? Yeah, it's Gyarados. Still not bad for me, though. I can just Will-O-Wisp that thing. Oh, it's Spatak boosting? Okay, they just lost their Moth. No, okay. Um, I'm gonna repeat that play. Was it actually Spatak boosting? All right, uh, let's Will O Wisp. Do I want to? Do I want to lose my sash? I don't think it matters too much as long as I KO this thing. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna headlong rush it. It should still do a ton. They might Terra. I don't know how much I really care. Air grass. Yep.
Let's see if they're Lum. I don't think so. I think in this format you'd run like AV. Still gonna do way too much. Yeah, close combat will KO. Let's see if they doubled me or not. Yeah, they doubled. That's fine. All of my mons are faster, and I have, like, just way too much pressure. Let's go with Flutter. Do I want to lock Dazzling Gleam? I'm not sure if I do. This is within Brave Bird range. I could, I could hit him with the Yoinky Splinky. Do I dare hit them with the Yoinky Splinky? I'm very tempted. I want to hit him with the Yoinky Splinky. I'm not locking Dazzling Gleam. There's no way that from this range, even at minus one, does it live a Brave Bird. That thing has god-awful defense. What's a Yoinky Splunky? You'll learn when you're older. I could have Power Gemmed, don't get me wrong. But I'm scared it's Assault Vest. And I think that if I just reset my Tailwind, I win. Yeah, that's AV. Good to know. It actually probably drops to the next one. <laughs> okay, that's not good. Um, it's not AV. It's just really fat. It's just really fat. I trained this thing, right? The special attack stat should be 205. There's their Fluttermane. How many turns of Tailwind do I have left? One? I have one turn left of Tailwind. Um, it is in my best interest to break their Focus Sash. Do I go gold? Oh, wait, this is rough, dude. This is so rough. I'm going gold and go, assuming that they want to go for another uh, Thunder Wave. Or even, like, protect. I think they're going to protect Thunder Wave, personally. They might be set. They might be specs. I don't know. Waterfall. I should live that. Yeah. Ooh, this is kind of rough. I really don't want to get thunder waved. Like that could like lose me the game instantly. The specs D gleam KO from this range. I really doubt it. I also can't afford to lock it in. Um. This is my only play. Maybe they miss a Thunder Wave. And it's also a speed tie here. Okay, I win the speed tie. I basically need them to somehow be slower than my Town Flame or miss the Thunder Wave because they're going to go for it. They taunted. They taunted. Okay, no, I can win. 
I can win. The only thing is I didn't get my taunt off. <laughs> uh, I think I still win if my if my tailwind goes off. That's the win con. Just don't get fully paralyzed. Or what if they're like Scarf Golden Go? <laughs> oh wait, no, I don't get Tailwind off. It's impossible. But I can't afford not to attack here. Oh, I'm Shadow Ball locked. Yeah, I can't afford not to attack. As much as I want to attack the Gyarados, if I attack the Gyarados, I lose. They have to like, not protect here. They're Scarf. Okay, that's game. That really sucks. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. They were Scarf. Alright, let's keep going. Claude Sire, okay. <laughs> I can't lose to Claude Sire. Oh, that's the wrong team. Sorry, I'm checking something. Okay, yeah, this guy is trained correctly. Uh, for this lead... I think they just kind of get stomped... by, like, Talonflame lead, dude. I think they really do just get stomped by that. I, I, yeah, I think I just power through it. Just hyper offense. But turn one, I'm probably just going to protect if they lead off with like Iron Hands. If I lose to Claude Sire, my fan base will never forget it. This is true. This is actually a true fact. Alright, they're not booster energy. Yeah, I protect here. In Tailwind. I'd imagine it's Terra Grass on the, uh... On the Flutter. Or not on the Flutter. On the uh, Iron Moth. Terra Grass? There it is. Silly little guy. Okay. So. Assuming they go for the fake out on my bundle, or not my bundle, on my town flame and not the Thunder Punch or Wild Charge, I should be fine here. Like, next turn, I just pick up two KOs. Alright, looks like they're gonna Thunder Punch, but I think I'm still fine. Heat Wave. You gonna KO my flame? Volt Switch? Oh, no, we live that. Yeah, we're max HP, we live. Uh, I like that, because I can just KO the, uh, I can KO the guy now. Depending on if what they send out is, like, a Sash user or not. Jugulus. Um, oh, and they're speed boosting. Uh, do I outspeed plus one Jugulus? Let me check, hold on. I do. Oh, uh, let's do this. Alright, cool. Got the play right. 
<laughs> Got the player out. There's no way he lives. Goodbye. Nice. Well, the thing is, I'm adamant Tusk. I'm not Jolly. That's what. That's why I have to be like careful with these. I have to like learn these uh, speed tiers. Backs. Um. I think they're just gonna ice shard me. I could close combat backs and save my tailwind for later. I think I do that. Yep. Let's pick up our second KO. Dude, Tusk is insane, bro. Tusk is just gonna run through this whole team. Why Adamant? Uh, it's it's like for the Ndidi Armor Rouge matchup. It makes it much more reliable to tear a ground Earthquake KO things. Also, I just like clicking Adamant moves. It's very funny and very strong. Um, I'd imagine this is going to be a sack on Golden Go, but I can just make it rain here. And protect. I welcome my Golden Go to be KO'd by, like, Heat Wave or something. Oh, that is a slow Pokemon, dude. Alright, please KO Golden Go. I actually imagine they doubled it. Oh, I avoid. Oh wait, I get outsped. I don't outspeed because my tailwind's still up. I forgot my tailwind was still up. I'm so silly, guys. I'm so silly. Uh, let's do this. Let's go for another make it rain. And I just want to make sure my tailwind goes up so I win. So I'm going to go Talonflame here. No, that's a Vorbit. Sick. I really wanted to win with the, with the dude, you know? Give Tusk Precipice Blades? They really should. They really should. It's only fair. Alright, one more. Should we do one more? Or do I cut it off there? I might cut it off there. I'm gonna cut it off there. All right. Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate you. For watching on YouTube, leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.